Hello buddies. Welcome back to Quick Movies today, I'm going to explain a 2022 movie called The Invitation. In the start of a scene we see a lady who looks extremely troubled and frightened she is seen running off from something in a huge house she then bounces from the rooftop with piano surprises to her neck and commits suicide. We currently meet the hero Evie at an occasion considered find yourself where she fills in as an independent food provider with her companion Evie is battling with the lowest pay permitted by law and lives in a little condo. Her folks died so she has no family to consider her own and chose to take a DNA test in order to find her tragically missing relative now she sent her DNA and viewed an Englishman who occurs as a cousin. Her companion tells her it very well, maybe a catfish however Evie was anxious to know her family ancestry and has chosen to meet the individual, they meet in an eatery and discuss themselves to get to know one another. He tells her that their cousin Martin and his fiancée Cecile of the DeVille family are getting hitched in the open country and welcomes her to the wedding Evie, then acknowledges his challenge to find out about her family's ancestry. Evie shows up at the UK and is welcomed by his cousin Oliver at the air terminal Oliver then takes her to the DeVille's home New Carfax Monastery in the wide open with a wedding festivity will be held she unintentionally finds Dia and Imogen who are as of late delegated house cleaners at DeVille home. Evie then meets the top of the head servant Mr. Field who is an impolite individual the two of them were unexpectedly hindered by a youthful attractive man whom his cousin Oliver acquainted with her as the ruler of the estate Walter DeVille Evie is accompanied inside the house by the steward, she was awed by the glorious excellence of the chateau and furthermore advised her to avoid the library room because of redesign, she is then presented by a women house cleaner Mrs. Quick who takes her inside the room, she then, at that point, Coincidentally found a picture and asked the servant who told her she was the previous woman of the house who had died as of late around evening time she was chatting on a telephone with her companion she heard thumping on the entryway who is walled he then apologizes for the steward and to begin things once again in a legitimate manner and get to know one another better Evie later goes for running and inevitably she stops and hears somebody conversing with her she turns around and finds somebody gazing at her from the manor's window she then at that point Awakened from the fantasy terrified Evie, then chose to get herself a glass of water and saw the steward giving tasks to the housekeeper somebody behind her is seen attempting to contact her however as she turned it vanished the women servant then advises her to return to the room since it's perilous around here around evening time the head servant takes the way into the library room and advises one of the servants to go in for a last cleaning round she then lights the flame and starts tidying up the room, after some time, the candle goes out without help from anyone else and as she lights it again it goes out again now she feels like somebody is following her and starts getting found she looks gradually towards the roof and saw something animal-like substance it bounced at her and kills in the long run the following day. The women maid awakens her from rest telling her that the family gathering has started she then, at that point, gets dressed and meets. His uncle Julius and different family members his distant uncle Alfred then, at that point, raised a toast to invite Evie the head servant then advises two of the servants to go get wine from the basement sadly they would meet a similar destiny like the other servant Evie currently shows up at the party and meets Victoria and Lucy not long after Walt entered the scene she asked Evie for a dance the two of them moved together alongside different couples. Evie and Walt started began developing to like each other Evie is then awakened from her rest and gets extremely frightened subsequent to seeing a brief look at what is large lengthy hands with sharp nails she then conceals under the bed terrified. Soon after Walt is found in the room and solaces Evie by saying nothing remains to be frightened of and that there's nothing here Walt remained at her room together and dozed as they talk next morning Victoria and Lucy comes at her room and takes. Evie for a spa day Lucy is well disposed yet Victoria then again is a remarkable inverse she then leaves after Victoria prodded her at the spa Evie then slips into the library room and finds a document about her she blows up and begins pressing his effects to leave yet she is interfered with by three-step dance who figures out how to convince her not to avoid both become exceptionally close in the wake of investing energy with regard to no place Waltham requested that she wed close by Evie's cousin Martin as in a twofold wedding and she then at that point expressed yes later on she said that she was just kidding Walt grins and leaves the room. Evie then, at that point, shows up at the practice supper likewise there are three families the Willingtons of Whitby the cop loads of Budapest and the Alexanders of London and after in no time declaring the gala Evie asked Walt where are the lady of the hour and husband to be he grins and unexpectedly reports his wedding to Evie everybody at the table began applauding as Evie apprehensively considered what simply happened Walton requested reward. One of the servants who was serving right now would meet a horrendous end the head steward, cut the neck of the housekeeper and fill the cup with her blood Evie currently acknowledges how she caused herself problems the three families served the DeVille family with ladies to reinforce their solidarity and power Victoria and Lucy are both hitched to the undying vampire Walt he tells about Emmeline Evie's extraordinary grandma and she comprehended all that about what was happening Emmeline was the one from the start scene and the picture in her room she dreaded as they drank the house cleaner's blood with unadulterated euphoria Evie had a go at taking off yet wasn't permitted to do as such rather they tied her up to a seat soon Victoria and Lucy showed up attempting to cause her to comprehend that they would become sisters now Victoria puts her inside the casket and is subsequently delivered by the women house cleaner. After asking her for what valid reason she was helping she answered that she was a dear companion of her. 
Extraordinary grandma being hitched to that beast is the explanation her incredible grandma committed suicide she tells her that they can be killed exclusively with stake executing or fire Evie advances outside and individuals are looking for her she goes in a horse shelter just to figure out that it was an unloading stockpiling of the dead bodies Evie rapidly conceals under a table the steward shows up with a dead mate's body, telling one of his men that she will not get far and that he will. Look through her she gasped as blood trickles down her cheek Evie figures out how to move away from the stable and locks the steward inside. She finds a close by town and thumps on a house entryway, two several invites her and told to call for help she was checking out the room when she saw the couple in representation with the Deville family steward while attempting to endeavor and get away from the couple hit her unconscious. Later, she awakened and wound up with Walt back in the chateau Evie currently strolls towards wedding raised area strongly to wet Walt with no other choice. Left she chooses to wed him at the function Evie. Drank Walt's blood transformed into a vampire and acquired tremendous strength she then, at that point. Liberated the servant who was hanging and consumed the room by crushing the candles Walt furiously strolled towards her yet Evie cut him with a major piece of wood in his chest Evie and the house cleaner began running yet come by Victoria tells Evie that Walt isn't dead yet has a non-critical injury soon Lucy comes to her guide Lucy pushed Victoria towards a wooden lance thusly both would meet their grievous end Evie then encounters a head servant and luckily kills him with a wrecked lance Evie presently faces the final peril Walt had the high ground while participated in an extreme battle she then, at that point. Hacks his hand to liberate herself from his gagging Walt tells her that she ought to be thankful for the timeless life and power she has she kicks him into the pool of blazes that overwhelmed the entire manor as he killed him her power dwindled and she became mortal. Again she leaves this franticness with feeling of having alleviation eventually. Sooner or later Evie and his companion are seen following Oliver the two of them have been wanting to take him out and as they head towards the structure where Oliver entered this is where the film closes. Thanks for watching. Please buddies subscribe my channel to watch more videos like this, turn on notifications, and leave a like to help the channel out.